We always look forward to it. And uh, we're looking forward to the weekend, although the weather will be a little bit chillier. The weather's going to be chilly, Jim. In fact, it's a chilly end to our work week. After such a beautiful Thursday, daytime highs on Thursday soared into the low 70s, challenging daytime high records right here in Philly. The record 75, and we broke into the low 70s. So a very warm Thursday, followed by a cold end to the work week. Let's go ahead and check in with our weather watchers. They are up with us and. We'll start in the Lehigh Valley. Claudia is reporting a temperature, check this, of only 35 degrees. And as always, she left us a little note. She says, that lunar eclipse was awesome last night. So glad the clouds moved out ahead of it. And yes, we were definitely glad that that system that brought the rain overnight yesterday was gone in time for us to enjoy the lunar eclipse. Let's check in with Dolores. She's down in Newark, Delaware. A temperature of 42 degrees outside of her door. She says, hi, Larissa. Beautiful full moon setting in the clear northwest sky. Good morning to you, Dolores. Thank you for that observation. It's a chilly morning, a frosty morning across the region. So just make sure to bundle up. We're talking temperatures in the 40s and 30s and even 20s across our local neighborhoods. But as we zoom on out, you can see that the true cold air is still contained and confined to the northwest or to our western suburbs. And we're talking well west, the interior northeast. That's where it's only in the 20s. Pittsburgh sitting at 29. And some of that colder air will be making its way into our region more so tonight than today. Day. This is what Storm Scan 3 is showing. A few lake effect snow showers are moving into parts of the region. Very light, falling very lightly. That's not going to be a problem throughout the day. Highs are scheduled to climb into the 40s later on this afternoon. 49 tomorrow, Saturday. Rebound as far as temps are concerned Sunday. The next chance of rain arrives Sunday night and into Monday. Thank you, Larissa. Let's take a look.